This is the best automatic crop farm in Minecraft. All you gotta do is plant your crops and wait for them to grow. With a simple click of the lever, all your crops will be harvested and they'll be stored in this chest. You can expand this farm outwards if you would like. And this is all the materials needed for the tutorial. The area needed for this tutorial is an 18 by 12. The first thing we're gonna do is mine eight blocks like so. Add a water bucket so it flushes to the end. We need to mine these three blocks here and another three underneath. Place a double chest and a hopper going into the chest. And then a glass block on this chest here. Now what you're gonna do is place eight blocks like so. So it's basically one away from the hopper. And then you do another one here. Come four blocks up, mine this block here and this grass block. Add a bucket of water and then cover it up and you do it on the other side so the farmland is hydrated. Get yourself a hoe and then start tailing the ground. Add any crop of your choice on the farmland. Now you want to make an 8x7 platform. Now place another row of blocks alongside the farm. Come to the centre, break this block here, add a leaf block and waterlog it. Cover it up and you do this on this side as well. Now you can tail the ground and add any crop of your choice. Now place a row of blocks at the back of the farm and on top of those row of blocks, you wanna add pistons facing towards you. The next step is to double up the railings. So we're just gonna do that now. At the back where the pistons are, you just wanna add another row of blocks to the end. Now it's time to add the redstone. So now add a lever at the front add redstone dust all the way up to this point here add a lever and carry on placing redstone dust now the piston is going to get activated here and this is where the water is going to be so we need to add a repeater here a block here and then carry on your redstone dust going all the way around and then what we can do is add a solid block going all the way around and same across here like so so when we activate the lever all the pistons should get activated and the water can just sit flushly on top of the extended pistons so when the farm is ready to be activated all we're going to do is lift that lever up and all your drops will end up in this water channel going straight into the hoppers since all the farmland has grown, we can activate the lever, watch all the water, flush all the items to the water channel. As you can see, none of the items get stuck on here, all the sides, it all gets pushed into this channel, and then you can open the chest and see all your loot there. If you did enjoy this tutorial, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe for more tutorials like this in the future, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.